Let's get rhythmically creative with reverb. Creating custom pre delay times to use reverb as an instrument in its own right. It's in all seriousness, because this isn't connected to anything. In all seriousness, this trick is really cool. It's one of my favorite tricks and it's super creative, interesting, but also simple enough for anyone to know. So I put this down because that's that's not doing anything. Let's dive in. Pre delays that gap in time between the sound happening and the reverb coming in. For example, using today's sponsor, the Transatlantic Plate Reverb from Rare Signals, one of my favorite analog modeled reverbs. But more about that later. Let's, let's dive back into knowledge. Wouldn't it be cool if we could somehow sync this to the grid, possibly with extremely long times? Well, we can. The trick to this is using a delay, as, such as a simple delay. But first, you need the reverb in its own processing chain, which you could do either using, say, a return track or maybe a rack, as you see here in Ableton. Anything works. Importantly, we need the reverb in its own processing chain. So we set the wet to 100 and then add a delay just in front with 0% feedback and 100% wet. So it's effectively just a time delay delaying the reverb by the amount we set up here in the time, the delay time. Therefore, this delay time is the pre-delay, which we can sync to the grid and therefore get creative with. We're getting rhythmically creative. Here's another example, slightly different genre. It's using reverb as an instrument. I think it's, it's super interesting and something I don't see too many people doing. And before I give you the final tip, taking things to the next level, which will blow your mind in, in all seriousness, let me tell you something about today's sponsor. Use code multiplier, which is my name, to, to get this reverb on discount from, from Rare Signals. Link below the transatlantic plate reverb. Oh, in fact, it's called transatlantic because of this button here, changing between the EU and US, the, the Europe, and United States of America, and it's the transatlantic, because of the, of the big ocean where all, all the fish live, between America and Europe, each being a different analog reverb they modeled. So that explains the name, transatlantic plate reverb. As I say, code multiplier to get it on discount for only $99. And finally, the final tip of the vid video, video, the final tip of the video, focus multiplier, jibber jabbering complete. The final tip of the video to take things to the next level in creativity is to, well, let me show you. Ooh, what's going on there? Well, take another listen. If you get creative with this, you can make a multi pre delay, a pre multi, a multiplied, a multiple pre delay, but multiple, multiple pre delays, multiple delays. What's going on there? That's outrageous. Multipliers multiplied the pre delay and some sort of multiplication madness. Well, as you can hopefully see here, for example, in the Ableton racks you can simply create multiple instances, each instance with a different pre-delay time, quantized, of course, as you can see, making it rhythmic in this next dimensional awesomeness, as you can see here. Multiplier, that's outrageous. You're, you're getting too creative here. What am I gonna do? Probably give it a go if I were you. That, that's, I rhymed, I'm like a rap star, but in a video, like a YouTube rap star. YouTuber rap star, rapper do too, Bob. Give it a go. Catch you guys on the flippity flip.